Not sure how many times I'm going to have to do this. This is pissing me off. Hey there, Sherry here, giving you my five tips on what I've learned so far halfway through uh, competition photo uh, meal planning. And I'm just going to do this quick and easy. I have five things and starting with number one. First of all, plan your water. You need to plan how much water you're going to have throughout the day so that you get it all in. I've personally been struggling with getting in two gallons of water. So planning to get in that first gallon by noon, planning to get the rest of it in by afternoon. Maybe you have a goal hourly, I need to be drinking 16 ounces. Whatever works for you, pre-plan your water. Number two, also pre-plan your meals. Know how many calories you have and plan them out a day in advance so that tomorrow when you get to breakfast, you know what you're having, you know what you're having for snack, you know what you're having for lunch. And by pre-planning them, you'll also be looking at how many calories you need, how many um, carbs, proteins, fats, sodium. Watch all of those to make sure they're within the guidelines of what's laid out in the plan. Number three is to track your calories. Now that you've pre-planned it, stick to what you have so that you know, yes, I ate only what I put on my plan. So that when you get to 10 o'clock, you eat your snack. At 10.30, you think, oh, I wish I could have something more. First of all, you don't go off plan. Should that happen, maybe you should drink some more water or tip number four, Take small breaks throughout the day. Walk around, uh, do something active, maybe clean a cupboard, whatever works for you. Kind of keep a little bit active throughout your day. Maybe a walk or some breaks in your day if you're at work. And lastly is to have a support group. Make sure that your family is involved, your friends on Facebook, some groups, other people to help you through this process. It is a very big challenge, the competition prep week uh, photo shoot plan. It is something that is not meant for everybody to do. And if you're trying it, make sure you have people around there to support you so that when you say, oh, I'm, I'm I'm going to throw my hands up and I'm going to go off the plan that you have somebody there to say, no, 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 stick to it and be your little cheerleader. That's my five tips that I've learned so far through the week, and I hope they help you. Bye.